So uh, hello guys. Uh, for today is we will be uh, catering this uh, request from uh, Heron Radats. So there's a problem with the uh, API, I guess, and this uh, load MCU is uh, it can't connect to the Heroku hosted uh, socket server so we will be doing this one and so uh, shout out to Sir Heron uh, so uh, I've already created the video so I'm in the project so we just walk you to it so here's the So here's the code for the uh, node MCU and here's just a single file, a uh, single file project. Uh, so again, uh, this, uh, this is like the, the template for all my projects, so it's just almost the same. So I just use Koa for my server, uh, not Express. So here is the IO, I mean the the socket IO connection. Um, so here is if there's a client that connects, it will just console of this one, the ID and the origin, and then it will emit this uh, event. Congrats to all the clients. Then the client will reply okay. So it's just a basic uh, socket IO uh, demo. So let's go back to my browser. So right now is I don't have a uh, Heroku uh, project. So I will also show to you how to deploy one. So you must have uh, the Heroku CLI uh, installed. So if we just search in the and then double install so just select for your uh, editing system so i use this one the curly standalone so once you have uh, installed the local cli just run the command Then we'll just generate this one. So let's the link. So nothing right now. So I refresh this. So here's our app. So to push this project to the yellow code, just do uh, keep so let's do the command get uh, push master. So by the way, you must have also the this one, the start command because uh, the Heroku will use this one. I guess you can, can uh, modify it here. So, I guess you can modify it here, but uh, this is just a simple demo. So here, here is our API, which is successfully deployed in Heroku, which is this one. Welcome to this API. So if you want, like a uh, CICD or auto deployment. So let's just connect our GitHub and then this one and search. So every time I will push to this uh, to the repo, is I will put enable. I will enable auto deployments. So example is 
So let's create and uh, let's commit this API. Mm, let's just put this. Uh, let's push this to master. So uh, it must trigger this, uh, this one, the activities. Uh, there, built in progress. Uh, you can also check using the Heroku CLI. So just run Heroku log save. So here it's running now. So let's refresh. Here's the so here's the logs of our API. So let's just remove the that one. Let's commit again. It will also log here to trigger the deployment. So, like this one. Let's go over here. Let's go back here. Okay, then it is done. Let's refresh the page. Here it's already running, so let's refresh. So that's really good. Uh, that's it. Uh, we have successfully deployed our app in Heroku. So I guess I'll just continue the video. I won't cut this one. So next part is we will now uh, create our, I mean, upload our code, our node C code. So here's my device here. I just plug it in. And I'll copy this code. And open my Arduino ID. Here's my RDA guys. I'll just copy and paste it. Uh, so it's uh, it's the example of the library, this one, the Sakatai of client, which is in my previous uh, tutorial. So I just added here, I mean I just refactor this one, the potential of the Wi-Fi. Then I add the event, which is this one. So upon connecting to the server, it will emit the congrats event. So this one, congrats, then it will just print the serial monitor. The This one, the message has already connected. Then on the void loop, I just, we will just run it one time. The, we will, uh, at least we will emit the OK event which is this one then in the Heroku CLI uh, this thank you message must be displayed in the logs so that's it uh, let's upload this one and the I have to save this I just copy this in the the example so I don't have to save if I and also we will replace this one I replace the, the link which is uh, this one And 
I said so. That's right. That's it. Let's try to live. Let's try to upload. Because I have clicked the, the upload button. Obviously. You can just, uh, let's just wait, guys. I won't even bother to edit this uh, story. Yeah. So let's see our scale monitor. Uh, that's it. Uh, yeah, I successfully connected to our socket server. And this one, the message successfully connected. It's from this one. This one, the unit. And that's and here in the the logs of the Heroku is this one message thank you so let's try again to replace the message okay thanks that's good And let's just wait again, guys. Yeah. Oh, the the character it's just 24 characters so you can just adjust this guys if you didn't and here didn't team it so, so let's adjust this to four five And now you know, finish uploading. So let's just, just check. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Good subs. Then here's the message from our uh, from our Heroku. I mean from our server, socket server. Then here's the socket very connected. Uh, so I guess that's it, guys. So I hope answer the name again, sorry. Sir Heron, so I guess I answer this one. So uh hope you learned something new guys and don't forget to leave like and subscribe. So thank you.